Today, I want to share with you one idea that I... It, it was an experience, but uh, this whole story and everything will be an idea uh, to be used for anything that you want to achieve or creative things. So to say, creative process. If you are in, in something, creating something, then this might uh, help you to finish it, to get it done, so to say. So basically, uh, I had an experience to that um, I realized there is something larger than me. I realized that uh, I tapped into the universal storage, so to say, of information. Like where everything is connected, everything that you need is there. And so therefore anything you need, you can find it there. So basically everything that uh, was or is or it will be it exists already in, in one space, so to say. And to my opinion, I think this is the universal storage. I, I call it like that. So basically you have the access of, to it. And by maybe saying this explains a bit more. Universe has its own vibration. And we as human beings, we're having our own vibration. Um, brain has a vibration as well. And emotions having probably vibration as well and therefore for example when we are sleeping while we are sleeping the brain waves are like let's say uh, 4 hertz or 6, uh, six uh, hertz or something like that uh, for example and if you're able to lift your vibration to match uh, your vibration to line up your vibration with uh, universal vibration you basically become one uh, with the with the universe itself and therefore you're having the access to all the informations that you Will ever need you know to finish or get things done or whatever you're doing right now and I had this experience and that changed my point of view about who I am and uh, What is this all about and so on? So basically um, When you line up with that kind of vibration you will have uh, access to everything instant access to each and every sit moment and every like instant understanding about everything and anything that is going on around you uh, without per perhaps talking about it just inner knowing about everything about each person that you meet that you're sitting with or about anything that is going on in the outer world you will have the uh, internal answers instant internal answers for everything so that can be very help helpful uh, whether you're in a business or whether you're whatever you're doing in your life um, what I wanted to say yes uh, so we are living in a era of information like everything that is going on is about informations and if you can have the access to every uh, information that was is or it will be you can basically download the ideas uh, from the universe itself you can get things done much more faster if you understand this true and I think I'm not the first one who is talking about this uh, there are top there are people that were doing these things and talking probably and there are things written about this but uh, no one is talking I'm not hearing people often talking about it so I thought like hmm let's share this uh, my first understanding of the of the wealth of the planet the richness of the planet so to say like how, how lucky you are to be alive and to have this knowledge that is available like right now you're hearing this um, so if you're living in the era of informa information and you're having access to everything and you know how to line up yourself with the universal frequency in order to download the ideas and solutions like I mean you have everything that you need you're lucky you're lucky to be alive and then like all worrying and everything like uh, obstacles are becoming uh, funny because when you realize this true and experience it understand it it's really it becomes very life becomes very funny and uh, like a play like a game almost it's there's no there's so uh, few things that are really like so to say serious they're not the life itself is not serious. 
it's very really not serious. But we take it so like it's, you know, like we're gonna die and, you know, we will disappear forever, whatever. You know, like, that's really... A life is supposed to not be like that, I think. Um, what else I wanted to share today is that we are living in the era of information and we have access to everything, yes. And basically, it starts with that, uh, it starts with your truth. Uh, the truth is the strongest thing and it's authentic. It's basically your nature. Uh, but you, most of the times, for most of the people, uh, we lost that kind of uh, what is true for us, what is really authentic to us, what is our authentic nature. And therefore we started to drift and to fulfill uh, someone else's idea or ideas, uh, like work and so on and so on. And therefore we lost our, our power, we lost uh, our uh, true authenticity. And how you start all this, how you start to, to access this uh, kind of things and to start living like this is basically following your own truth and not uh, the truth like uh, okay if I do this I'll be liked for that because I did that for others no you're doing it basically for yourself that's a, a healthy thinking it's not selfish at all it sounds like selfish but it takes uh, really uh, a bit thinking about it like Wait, if I'm not happy, you will not be happy for sure, you know? And that's how it starts, basically. To, to fulfill your real true desires, your real needs, not the needs of someone else. When you're fulfilling the needs of someone else's or ideas, you will never be happy. You will never start to feel excited. You will never start to feel uh, like uh, happy about the things that will happen or that are happening because you know you're lying yourself. And your brain knows it, even if it's not clear, like on a on a conscious level. If it's a, in a subconscious level, like somewhere deeper inside of you, your you, your being know knows that you're lying yourself, and therefore there is no the power is not there. Where the truth is, there is power. Where where it isn't, there is not. And it's so simple. So that's how it starts. Um, you follow your own path you you have to define what 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 are your needs and wants and to start go for it the answers the answers will come um to me it happened like uh, i don't know eight years ago or something i have no idea you will get the, everything that you need you will get the right book you will meet the right person you will start to to you will start to getting the answers and the feedbacks and everything that you need the informations and so on everything will be there actually and just do it that's basically it um what i wanted to share is hmm, yes fulfilling the other people's uh, ideas um basically that they're not resonating with you that's that's the key if if they're if you're fine with that if they resonate with you their ideas and ideals and everything then it's fine. If not, then you have to start asking yourself, hmm, what's my way actually here? What 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 is my true nature? What what supplies do I? What uh, what is really that I want to do? What really feels right for me? Um, and what I wanted to say with that is, <coughs> sorry. <coughs> what I wanted to say with that is that. Basically, if you, you'll never be uh, fulfilled if you start following what is false, what is not true, okay? And the first time, so this thing connect uh, with this one, with the experience that I had. When you really experience something that is really awesome, um, even if it feels uh, exciting, great, and you're so happy, you're like, you know, you don't need to drink, you don't need to eat, you know, you don't need to sleep, you feel just awesome. You don't need anything. You just want to share that uh, awesomeness, so to say, excitement with others. Um, in your brain, it kind of like, in your being, inside of your brain, something, uh, you, you get the uh, anxiety as well. You get the fear. 
you get an anxiety because to my opinion you're not used to it to feel great to have a great life to have a great things in your life and once that happens, when you like connect with the universe itself and with the storage and you feel so connected with everything and anything and having this instant understanding like uh, then anxiety kicks in because uh, that's not something that you were doing like fulfilling other people's needs and ideas and you start to fulfill yours and you feel like uh, kind of uh, um, is this right? Is this okay? Am I gonna get in trouble because of that or not? That's that's all about. You, you will maybe experience this kind of thing. Uh, just be fine with that. Nothing bad will happen actually. To me never happened bad, anything like that. I, I have this uh, uh, experience for three times or four times. Ne never nothing happened, like bad happened. Just good, just good things actually. And basically it's like switching this, like it's okay for me to have what I want to be, what I want to be and to do what I want to do. And it's okay to be great and it's okay to be awesome and it's okay to be excited and to be excited. And this is what I want actually to share with you. It's okay to, to switch to a bit adjust, you know, the settings and everything that you're having in your head about fulfilling your needs, not the other people's needs and ideas that you think that are very important, but they're actually not. There is no such thing, more important thing than uh, uh, finding your own truth and following yourself, uh, expressing that whatever it feels right for you. That's the only, that's the only key. That's the only truth. Everything else is less important. So I hope this kind of, this idea about uh, having ability to actually uh, be connected with everything and anything um, and having this access to, to everything. Um, it might give you some ideas about the life and what should you do and what you, what you should not do and so on. So I hope this kind of, uh, this idea helps you about uh, seeing different perspectives, seeing different angle of life. So, and um, see you in the next one. Thank you. Maybe uh, one more important thing to put in this video as well. I just remembered. Um, there is a there is a one uh, there is a one quote of the opera of Winfried, and I will just post it like as a picture here, so you will see it on the screen. Uh, have a good day. See you next video.